So you and Leo back together. Mm -hmm. That's what everybody's going to be talking about in this movie, of course. It would seem so. <laughs> <laughs> it would make a lot of sense. Yeah. How, did it, how did it feel? Was it easy? Did it just slip right back into the groove? It's very easy to be around somebody that you know as well as, you know, I know Leo and, and he knows me. You know, we are very, very blessed to have, you know, worked together 12 years ago and to have gotten along. You know, I think that's the thing I'm most struck by in talking about this experience of making Revolutionary Road together. You know, none of this would have happened if it hadn't been for the fact that we always just got along really just fine. And... Uh, and that friendship has stood us in good stead over the years and um, was very beneficial to us um, in playing Frank and April Wheeler. We were able to you know, use some of our own life experiences and some of the things that we've gone through together um, in playing these characters. And when you have that level of trust with somebody, with another yeah. actor, when you have that emotional shorthand, you know, it really means that there are absolutely no boundaries. And so in some of the difficult scenes, the more emotional scenes, um, some of the arguments that Frank and April have um, on screen, uh, we could really let rip and, yeah. and know that it was going to be okay and be able to be there for each other and support each other and yeah. yell at each other and hurt <laughs> each other and know that we were still going to be just friends at the end of the day. What do you think it is? Why is it that you guys you know, get along so well and have formed this friendship? What is it about your personalities that works? Um, I think that uh, I think it's a combination of a few things. Um, you know, on the, on the surface, it would seem that we're quite different. You know, he's American, I'm English. People always assume that I'm sort of this classically trained, you know, English rose, whatever. And the truth is, I'm really not that person at all. <laughs> and in many ways, we're kind of cut from the same cloth. You know, we uh, very similar upbringings um, and similar experiences coming into the world of movies quite young and really not having a clue what we were doing, just knowing that we felt like we'd won a lottery ticket and got very, very lucky um, and very much had to learn on the job. You know, that's yeah. what no one can teach you how to be a film actor. You know, they can tell you what it might be like, but until you're there, you really don't know. Um, and so we just experienced a lot of the similar things uh, to each other. And, um, and m maybe, maybe that's why. And uh, as actors, we, I think, work in quite a similar way to very, um, very thorough, very experimental, um, you know, supportive of everyone ar around us, collaborative. Um, and, 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 you know, that's kind of rare, too. You know, actors yeah. can be very different, work in very different ways. And uh, we've always had that similarity, so it stood us in good stead. How would you say that he's changed the most since the 11 years since Titanic? How has he changed? It's got to be more wrinkles, you said. Oh, we've both got a few more <laughs> wrinkles. But you know what? The truth is, I, you know, I'm, I'm really proud of them. And actually, when I watch Revolutionary Road and I see our faces and how much of the movie was actually played in close-up, and that was a style choice by um, Sam Mendes, my husband, and uh, Roger Deakins, <laughs> the cinematographer. You know, they really wanted to see everything that's going on in the faces of all the actors. And, uh, and I'm proud. I sit there and I go, wow, damn, look at my forehead moving. Look at his forehead moving. Look at our <laughs> anger. Look at our pain. And you can really see it. And that's what acting's about. Um, you were the one who actually sent him the script, right? Leo, yes. Uh, you yes, said, I, I want to work together with you again, and I, mean, I like the script. Let's do it. Well, you know, the truth is, over, over the years, um, you know, we we have kind of quietly tried to find something to do together again, and I think we always knew that uh, we would only we would only do it when it really felt like it was worth doing, you know, mm -hmm. something with big, weighty characters that would challenge us and... Um, uh, and, 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 you know, it wasn't until Revolutionary Road, quite, quite honestly, that we felt that that thing had come along. And, and maybe you have to compete against yourself and before you leave. i got to show you these cute pictures, these beautiful pictures. You've seen them, huh? Oh, it's me. It's you being gorgeous. I've seen My them many God, times. your I body the, looks I fabulous. The, I have the prints. But, Kate, i gotta, I got to just embarrass you a little bit because your body looks so good, right? Oh, lucky, lucky, lucky. Gorgissimo. Oh. Your body looks amazing. Yeah, doesn't it? Been working out? Yeah, it does. <laughs> hey, you say it proudly. I'm just going to nod and say, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that looks good. That Because you're proud good. of it, right? Well, you know, the truth is when you mm -hmm. do a photo shoot like this, which was to me very much playing mm -hmm. um, a character, it was a you know, highly conceptualized shoot. Mm -hmm. And um, Stephen Mizell is it's like working with Kubrick. I've never worked with him before. Yeah. Can you put that down now? Uh, no, um, I'm really going to The rest I of the interview, I'm just going to sit here like this. <laughs> there you go. It looks good. There on my backside. They're going to get my butt if I don't let you go. <laughs> but, you know, when you're 33 years old and you've had two children and you really don't feel like you have anything to hide and I feel pretty okay about how I look, um, you know, I thought to myself, yeah, I'm, I'm probably never going to do this again, so why not now? Why not now? Yeah. That's good. I like that philosophy. There you go. Well, you look good. Thank you. Yeah.